Hey, what's up guys? Jonathan here. Thanks for thanks again for checking out my channel. Today I'm at West Skiles Peacock Spring State Park. Um, this is actually a cave diver's dream. People come across from all over the world to explore this cave system. It's one of the largest cave systems with a spring that you can actually explore through. You can see I've already picked up some trash. But uh, alright, it's not really a, a great location for just swimmers so on it's it's got a one mile hiking trail to where you can kind of hike over where the spring actually runs to kind of explore it above ground while cave divers can explore underwater so i did bring my bike out today it's mostly for hiking but the bike's a little bit faster to get me around and um we're gonna take this trail see what it's like first i want to show you all the pretty interesting path to get from the front gate down to where the peacock springs is at hope you guys enjoy this video I'll see y'all in a second. Peace out. All right, guys, we're at the entrance. So you come down in here. It will give you a basic map of where you're at and where all the uh, educational stuff is, where the grove, where the spring's at. It's nice about this. Everything's like downhill. Here's a total thing where you pay your four to five dollars. If you're a diver, you sign in. That's where the grove's at. Which you'll see a video of it in a second. And you keep going down. Right up here on the right hand side is the little pothole sinkhole. And right up here is the parking area for the uh, entrance to the sinkhole. We just got all these little seats and stuff for you to hang your dive stuff on. There's my car. All right, I wanna show you all this real quick. One of the little spring heads. I think it's called Peacock 2 or something. But uh, all right. I'm gonna show y'all one other little thing. I'm gonna get bike, get my sweat up a little bit, and then I'm gonna get in the water. Uh, here's what I wanna show y'all. This is the little trail that goes to the Peacock to one head spring. This is where I took my video from. Yeah, there's already divers in the water. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm just going to wrap it up for the hike. It's actually a pretty good uh, mile hike slash bike ride because I did bring my bike. And um, every 20, 30 yards, they actually had a little uh, stamp, something that shows what trees are in the location, all the way to what different sinkholes. There's probably about five different sinkholes that you come across on that hike. And it's a really easy hike, not a lot of hills pretty flat for the most part and uh, definitely recommend it but now I'm actually out here at the head spring for a peacock and I'm gonna get in and show you guys the mouth of the cave of course I'm not going in the cave I'm not that stupid but uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah let's check out this area it is a beautiful 80 day water 72 
And uh, not gonna lie, the water's cold. But all right, let's do this. Let's show y'all what I see. See you in a second. Hey guys. What's up guys? All right, so I got my little tripod thing set up. So I'm gonna get some selfie stuff. I got a cool picture and uh, bring you guys along. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Guys, this area of the Peacock Springs is called the Grove. It next even has a handicap ramp to go down into the spring area. There's so much overgrown on it. 
That's crazy. You can even jump off that little blocker there into the water. Hmm. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up the uh, adventure for today. Like I said, I'm back out here at the West Skiles uh, Peacock State Park. Uh, beautiful location, great mile to hike if you wanna get some exercise, learn some stuff about the plants and the trees and some of the different sinkholes. If you are scuba certified for cave diving, I definitely recommend it. It's an awesome location. It's actually a huge cave system. I checked out two different watering holes, which y'all which y'all have probably already seen. One is the Peacock One, and there's another one called Peacock Two. But uh, yeah, glad I brought my bike. Still got plenty of light left. I'm gonna get out of here and uh, catch you guys next time on the next adventure. If you guys enjoy this park, or if you know a park that you want me to check out in the near future. Please leave it in the comments and I'll plan a trip to go out there and explore it for you so you have an idea of, of a better way to explore that park and get the most out of it. So that's what I'm hoping with this channel for right now with these little, because right now there's actually 175 different state parks. So I want to bring you guys along and check out each and every park that I go to and hopefully make it interesting to where you want to come out, bring out your friends and explore this park. This park is actually pretty clean. I think I may have seen a straw, a can, and a sock is all that I've found so far on the trails. But I'm gonna go throw that stuff away, get out of here, and catch you guys on the next adventure. Do me a huge favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification so you know that bell, so you know when I make another one, and I will catch you guys on the next adventure. Peace out, see y'all next time, bye.